South Sudan, the world's newest country. On July 9, 2011, millions of jubilant South Sudanese took to the streets celebrating independence. My goodness, we have a great joy for me and for the people of the Republic of South Sudan. This is the wonderful day we have all been waiting for. For decades, South Sudanese fought their northern neighbor in a war that claimed more than two million lives, left millions more homeless, and much of their country destroyed and underdeveloped. On the eve of independence, the UN Security Council passed Resolution 1996, authorizing the immediate creation of the United Nations mission in South Sudan. UNMIS is a peacekeeping mission with the role of supporting South Sudanese build a peaceful nation. The new mission is here to support the new and independent country. And the primary role basically is to help strengthen the foundations of the new state, the new country help build a new nation with its core institutions. Headquartered in South Sudan's capital, Juba, the mission operates across the country with 10,000 military, police and civilian personnel. Supporting their South Sudanese counterparts, UNMIS works in five main areas. Protection of civilians, human rights, peace building, the military and the police. Among many important goals, UNMIS is helping South Sudan adopt a permanent constitution, conduct a population census, hold free and fair elections, and promote the development of independent media. The mission works to help the world's newest citizens reap the benefits of independence. For UNMIS to be effective in supporting the nation, the government and the citizens need to show their commitment and act to build a new country. And as the world watches the first steps of nationhood of Africa's 54th country, UNMIS will work to help make the high hopes of Independence Day become a reality.